Hi everyone, welcome to Thirsty Thursday. It is bargain beer review time once again. Just as uh, before we get cracking on the beer though, just to clarify, to be a bargain beer on my show, you've got to cost one pounds and twenty-five English pence or less for a five hundred mil bottle. If it's a bigger bottle, that's okay. If it's a smaller bottle, that's okay. But your ratio pro rata, it's got to work out the equivalent of one pound twenty-five for a five hundred mil bottle. Up today, we've got a. From the Badger Brewery, it's their Golden Glory. Big fan of Badger. They are pretty, I sometimes think they're a bit like Jennings, as much that they never seem to make a bad beer. You get some breweries make, you know, you'll have one of beers, it's fantastic. You'll have another one, and it's mm, not so fantastic. Something like Badger, all of their stuff is always very consistently good. So I'm probably setting it up now for a big fall, but let's get this cracked and poured. Tips of scales at 4.5% on the ABV, and this cost me £1.25 English pence from supermarket chain Morrison's. Gold cap, badger logo, right, get this popped and poured and see what she's like. Ooh, lovely bit of can of smoke, nice hiss as well. Can of smoke still coming out. Got this at the fridge about five minutes ago, and we got a semi-nucleated glass. Ooh, look at that, pouring a nice amber goldy colour, to be honest. Let's put that down in the middle of the glass. I think the pouring's improved since I've been doing my beer reviews. It says here, amber bronze on the colour. Well, that is a, that's light in here. I've got some light coming through there as if I'm under a MI5 torturing spotlight or other secret agencies are. Of course, available. Get that carbonation. Good carbonation for this style of beer. That's a nice two finger, just slightly off white head. Fairly compact, tight bubbles. Going for a sniff. Oh yeah. Nectarine, peaches. Almost like the sort of fruit that if you've got a pot of yogurt or yogurt, as some people call it, and you get that nice fruit smell. That is what this is like actually, it smells absolutely delicious. So, peach, nectarine, a bit of elderflower on the back. Anyway, let's go in for a taste. Cheers everyone. Oh, that's nice. Very smooth, crisp, palate cleansing, light, fresh. Bittering kicking in now, probably on a scale of, you know, only a one to five, probably about a three on the bittering. Not overly sweet either. A little bit of glass lacing. Not real alcohol legs, but being 4.5%, wasn't really expecting expecting any. I um, was just trying to see if it mentions anything about the hoppage on this. Great artwork again, look at that. That is quite funky. Um, no... It's a, it is very zesty on the taste. Maybe it, a bit of like um, flowery, florally type notes coming through at the moment as well. Maybe a little bit peppery on there somewhere as well. So I'm assuming it's got fuggles in it and that is probably challenger as well. Uh, that is a very very tasty beer lovely color great head retention as well say one pound 25 morrison's if you see one go and get one pick one up give it a try i don't think you'd be disappointed that is a fantastic beer on a thirsty thursday score of uh, well out of 10 that for me is a very very nice i'm in a good mood i'm filming this easter weekend i've got Roast lamb in the oven because I've got my parents coming round. Um, yeah, life's good at the moment. I'm going to give that a 9 out of 10. If you see one, go and get one. Very, very nice indeed. Thanks for watching everyone and we'll see you again real soon right here. YouTube, Thirsty Thursday for another bargain beer review. Thanks for watching guys. Be seeing you.